Govern your island, Jose. Who'll run your industries? Hmm? Who'll handle your commerce? Who'll cure the sick? Teach in your schools. This man? Or that man, or the other. Civilization is not a simple matter, Jose. You cannot learn its secrets overnight. Today's civilization belongs to the white man, and you must learn to use it. Without it, you cannot go forward. But to go where, English? It is better that you too go away. Have I become so dangerous? Yes. Even for your own people, Jose. Well, I'm not now. But you can tell the white men. Tell your friends. They're not my friends, Jose. Well, no matter. You tell them. Be careful, very careful. They may know how to sell sugar, but we are the ones who cut the Now, cake. Jose Dolores says that if what we have in our country is civilization, civilization of white men, then we are better uncivilized because it is better to know where to go and not know how than it is to know how to go and not know where. And then? And then, Jose Dolores says, that if a man works for another, even if he's called a worker, he remains a slave. And it will always be the same, since there are those who own the plantations and those who own the machete to cut cane for the owners. And then? And then, Jose Dolores says, that we must cut heads instead of cane. There, that's Jose Dolores. At the bottom of the soldiers are running. Do you see him? Yes. A fine specimen, isn't he? Well, now, it's an exemplary story. In the beginning, it was nothing. A port or water carrier. And England makes him a revolutionary leader. And when he no longer serves her, he's put aside. And when he rebels again, more or less in the name of those same ideals which England's taught him, England decides to eliminate him. Don't you think that's a small masterpiece? And you're the author, Sir William. No, only the instrument. Giddy up. No, it is not true that fire destroys everything. A little life always remains. At any end. A blade of grass. So how come the white invaders win? How come they win in the end? Some one of us will always remain. Still others will be born later. And others too will begin to understand. And the end you also will understand. And the whites in the end will be maddened by you. Madder than a white beast becomes. When he finds his clothes thin, and the mad beast will run for the last time, pursued and hunted all over the island, till he falls into one of the great fires that he himself has made. And the groans from this dying beast will become a first cry of freedom, one that will be heard far, far beyond this island. Thank you. But anyway, sooner or later, they are going to kill me. Maybe not, General. Maybe they will let you live. If they let me live, it means it is convenient for them. And if it's convenient for them, it is convenient for me to die. Why? Because the hunter lets the hawk live. Only when he wants a decoy or to hunt in his place. He's kept alive 
by Nick Cage. But then, after a while, maybe they will free you. No, little soldier. It doesn't work like that, friend. If a man gives you freedom, it is not freedom. Freedom is something you, you alone must take. Do you understand? Well, you will one day, because you've already started to think about it. Right. But you see, the man that, that fights for an idea is a hero. And uh, a hero who's killed becomes a martyr, and a martyr immediately becomes a myth. A myth is more dangerous than a man, because you can't kill a myth. Don't you agree, Shelton? I mean, think of his ghosts running through the Antilles. Think of the legends and, and, and the songs. Better songs than armies. Better silence than songs. And that is? A hero that betrays is soon forgotten. Well, we'll have to see if he's willing to betray. Well, now let's see against whom did Jose Dolores rebel against Teddy Sanchez, and you, you general, have eliminated Teddy Sanchez. Now that, uh, I think that gives you a position in common. See, there's, there's the beginning of a rationale, which I think Jose Dolores could make public without too much shame. You think he will do it? Would you do it in his place? Me? Ha, for God's sake, Sir William, I would do anything to stay alive. But Jose Dolores... You can't tell what a man will do to stay alive. Until you put him to the test, you, you really never know. English! Remember what you said. Civilization belongs to whites. But what civilization? Until when? <laughs> 